Beloved, let us love one another, for love is from God, and whoever loves has been born of God and knows God. Anyone who does not love does not know God, because God is love. In this, the love of God was made manifest among us, that God sent His only Son into the world so that we might live through Him. This is love, not that we have loved God, but that He loved us and sent His Son as an atoning sacrifice for our sins. Beloved, if God so loved us, we also ought to love one another. No one has ever seen God. If we love one another, God abides in us and His love is perfected in us. A Prayer of Love by Debbie McDaniel Dear God, thank you that you are a loving, gracious God. Thank you that you've offered us forgiveness and the gift of new life in you. Thank you that your love is perfect, it never fails, and that nothing can separate us from your love. We pray that our lives would be filled and overflowing with the power of your love so that we can make a difference in this world and bring honor to you. We ask for your help in reminding us that the most important things are not what we do outwardly. It is not based on any talent or gift. But the most significant thing we can do in this life is simply to love you and to choose to love others. Lord, thank you that your love is patient. Help us to show patience with those around us. Lord, thank you that your love is kind. Help us to extend kindness to others. Lord, thank you that your love is not jealous. Help us cast aside feelings of jealousy or hatred toward others. Lord, thank you that your love does not brag and is not arrogant. Help us not to live with pride or arrogance, but choose to walk with humility and grace. Lord, thank you that your love does not act unbecomingly. Lord, help us to extend kindness instead of rudeness toward others. Help us to lay aside the critical tone and tearing down with our words so that we can truly walk in peace. Lord, thank you that your love does not seek its own. Lord, help us not to live selfishly, looking only to our own interests. Lord, thank you that your love is not provoked. Help us not to become easily angered. Help us not to be so quickly reactive, but instead slow to speak and slow to become angry. Lord, thank you that your love does not take into account a wrong suffered. Help us not to hold grudges, but to choose to forgive, even when it's difficult. Lord, thank you that your love does not rejoice in unrighteousness, but rejoices with the truth. Help us to love your words of truth, that we may walk in your freedom and wisdom. Let it be what drives our lives and our choices every day. Lord, thank you that your love bears all things, believes all things, hopes all things, endures all things. Thank you that your love never fails. Help us to love as you love. Fill us with your spirit so that we can choose what is best. We are weak, Lord, but we know also that even when we are weak, you are strong within us. Thank you that it is not all up to us. Thank you that you equip us to face each day with the power of your love, your forgiveness, and your grace. We love you, Lord, and we need you today and every day. In Jesus' name, amen.